As you can see elsewhere in the country, obviously very different weather from what we're having here. Here, just some clouds above Regents Field in downtown Birmingham, 75 degrees. They are playing baseball. UAB is hosting Florida Atlantic on this, despite the clouds, pretty nice afternoon. It will stay dry tonight. Good news there. We'll have some thunderstorms though coming through tomorrow afternoon and evening. Looks like a limited severe threat. I think there may be a few severe thunderstorm warnings, perhaps a severe thunderstorm watch at some point. Looking at radar right now, we are dry out there. It's a good start to our Friday evening. Back to the West a different story. Thunderstorm showing up from southwestern Missouri down through western Arkansas, and this system is marching pretty steadily eastward, and it looks like it will be the main weather maker here for tomorrow, especially in the afternoon and tomorrow evening too. Rain chance tonight is not zero, but it's close. 10%, 90% though tomorrow, so a dramatic difference. 40% on Sunday, back up to 80% Monday. I really think we're entering a fairly busy active pattern with at least some threat of severe weather a couple of times over the next seven days. There you see what goes on during the day tomorrow. Line of thunderstorms moves quickly across the area, and that means the possibility of a few severe storms. West Alabama, perhaps early afternoon along I-65, late afternoon and tomorrow evening too. And then it looks like later on tomorrow night, just a few lingering showers. But in any event, a fast line of storms coming through tomorrow. Those storms, again, could be locally heavy, maybe some locally strong winds with them as they move on eastward. Getting to I-65, it looks like maybe around 3 or 4 o'clock in the afternoon, something like that. Storm Prediction Center says from about I-65 on west, a slight risk of severe. East of there, a marginal risk. The reason the risk is less as you go eastward is that the support for this system probably pulls up as we get into the afternoon hours, and that would be in the storms that would lose some of their intensity over East Alabama. For this evening, no such problems whatsoever. Clouds are increasing across the area, but it will stay mild. A little bit breezy at times, too. 71 degrees at 7, 67 at 10 o'clock, down into the low 60s by late tonight, so it stays very mild all night long. Indeed, still plenty of mild conditions across the area. Everybody up in the 70s today. That's where we'll be again both tomorrow and Sunday. My forecast for tonight, skies overhead mostly cloudy, kind of breezy at times, a bit mild, too. 62-year low temperature. Tomorrow, the morning hours, maybe a stray shower, but some thunderstorms more likely later in the afternoon into tomorrow evening. A few could be severe, 76 for your high. Seven day forecast, few leftover showers perhaps on Sunday. I think on Monday, another round of potentially strong storms comes in. Get a couple days to break uh, after that, 78 degrees on Wednesday. More storms likely next Thursday. Not too surprising, we are entering the busiest time of the year in terms of thunderstorms. Guy and